From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us on this Monday, January 12, 2015. In the news, Alaska State and Wildlife Troopers wrapped up their high visibility anti-DUI campaign last week. Troopers enacted the campaign to protect motorists across the state from both impaired and aggressive drivers. According to a release, nearly 450 report every dangerous driver immediately or ready calls were placed throughout the campaign. 1,645 citations were issued, over 600 of those for speeding. The first wave of bills filed ahead of the upcoming legislative session include the topics of the permanent fund, the Alaska Judicial Council, and doing away with daylight savings time. Democratic Senator Bill Wilikowski is proposing a constitutional amendment to protect the permanent fund and the dividends. He said it would take a potential revenue source off the table as lawmakers grapple with deep budget deficits, but he said that's the point. He said there are other sources the state can consider, like setting what he considers a better gross minimum oil tax to protect the state. And Republican U.S. Senator Dan Sullivan of Alaska was sworn in last week in Washington, D.C., and though he's one of the newest lawmakers in the Senate, Sullivan has landed some solid committee assignments. He serves on the committees of Commerce, Science and Transportation, as well as the Veterans Affairs and Armed Services Committees. He also serves on the Environment and Public Works Committee, which has oversight over agencies such as the EPA. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today, mostly cloudy with occasional flurries, patchy fog, highs in the 20s. Tonight, partly cloudy, lows around 0 to 10 above. Tomorrow, increasing clouds with snow likely in the afternoon, highs in the teens. Maybe some wind and blowing snow over the summits through the period. Extended forecast is partly cloudy in teens on Wednesday, mostly cloudy in about 10 the rest of the week. Air index moderate in Fairbanks, moderate in North Pole, and the aurora forecast is low. That's all we have for right now, and we're glad you could join us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, you can download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching, and enjoy the rest of your day.